All right, we are here at our park once again. Avoiding the rain so far. It rained earlier, but now it's let up, and uh, we got another set to go. We got uh, Tom Jennings from the Niagara Gazette here. He wants to talk about how the uh, first set of Ian Anderson went. Good evening. Uh, you know, first set was, uh, well, obviously the rain kind of had the potential to dampen the spirits of the crowd, but it let up about five, maybe ten minutes before showtime. Early on in the set, Ian Anderson pointed over to the sky, saw a rainbow, and those are the types of moments that people really love at a live concert because it's unscripted, it's kind of cool. Uh, you know, an interesting show for Art Park. I think it's a great fit for this venue because it, it genuinely is very progressive, uh, progressive rocky, proggy, you know, whatever you want to call it, but uh, super artistic. I mean, it's not often you get to see a Bach piece on a Tuesday night. But uh, if you're going to do it anywhere, you're going to do it at a place like Art Park. And the crowd is is really into it. I mean, it seems like there's some real hardcore Jethro Tull fans that that really know their, their material. Well, you can always tell if you got the, the diehards because they seem to applaud at the right places. So I'm sure we're in for a great second set. Uh, second largest ticket sales of the season, from what I'm told, for Tuesday night. And uh, looks like Ian Anderson's living up to kind of show the people we're expected from him. All right, very good, Tom. Thank you. Thank you. From the soundboard.